Game of nine. Back at it. Good morning, y'all. Happy. Happy DC morning. Happy DC morning, people. Right now, what time? What time we got right now, boy? All right, 10. I think DC probably coming back home right now. Taking a little walk. But we got a problem, boy. We're walking in freaking Timberlands, homie. <laughs> I'll be okay, though. You know, you put them insoles in, it'd be rocking, but. Now, I wanted to say. So, hey, boy, I didn't know. I did not know Gum E had something dropping at the end bars. The Zeus? Zeus is, um, I can hardly see. Zeus is, um, lightning bolt. Yeah, the thing that was dropping in the survival mode. Now, that's a question. So, in survival mode, that was a big thing to get. The lightning bolt. Are they going to drop the, uh, what bat is that? It's the, it's not the vampire bat, it's the other bat. Not the construct bat, shadow bat, there you go. Are you gonna drop shadow bat somewhere? Like, let's say, let's say they be like, hey, um, we're gonna put shadow bat at the end of, you know, on the next DLC, we'll save the universe. What they have, just sneak dark, you know what I mean? What if they have us fight Dr. Fate and uh and Friends of Alliance? FOA, you know, FOAE. Well if he dropped the shadow bat. It had to be in chaos, right? That's where the shadow stuff came out, I think. I don't know. But yeah, so since they gave us one of the survival mode drops, I didn't give us the other one. You know, the, sh the shadow bat, boy. So that's that. Play, play the little gum. I think gum, I think gum E. I did gum E. And then I got, the, I got the, the Zeus, the Zeus thing that fell. Got that, I didn't know it was a thing. Got that, and then I played it again. At first I played it for the Phoenix, but it didn't fall. At least I didn't notice. <laughs> Got the Zeus thing. Didn't know that it was a thing. Then I played it again. Somebody else got it. Pretty cool. And man, that didn't go for some good money. I didn't know it was... That's why people was playing... Well, people wasn't playing it all the way through. Maybe with this last update, they made it come at the last boss movie. I didn't read all the update stuff. Real life now. Embarrassment. Remember, I always got to talk, talk to my brothers and sisters, most specifically my brothers and relationships they don't want to be in. Remember, uh, um, embarrassment is a mental construct, bro. Embarrassment is a mental construct. You may be like, Dad, if I leave her, her parents going to think bad of me. Oh my gosh, if I leave her, her friends, our friends are going to think bad of me. So what you do, you hang around, you don't move that PlayStation up out of her living room, which you call your living room, but it's not. <laughs> it's y'all, y'all share it. You stay with her. But then when you get caught and she flame you up all over social media and tell her friends and go all crazy, then you look stupid, you know, when you should have left. Forget that embarrassment stuff. You could go into 7-Eleven or wherever a little convenience store around your house. And that dude, when you walk in, there's no sign over your head saying, oh yeah, he just broke up. There ain't no uh, lettering on your forehead saying, yeah, he just broke up. She just pushed him, something like that. You know? Embarrassment is all a figment of your imagination. You'd be like, oh shoot, let's stay for the kids. You stay for the kids and then you get caught up cheating and then she end up telling the kids that you know good. And you're like, man, no, I, I should have been left. I've been wanting to leave. There are options. Remember, you go on Craigslist, you go somewhere, 
look for people renting a room out. You don't want to rent a room from no killer or no person who want to go on your stuff. And you want to be honorable in your leasing of a room, also renting of a room. You go in somebody's basement. Because what happens in our brain, we'd be like, oh, shoot. If I leave her, she's going to be sad. Oh, man, I can't leave. But then you end up staying and getting embarrassed like I don't know what. And you don't even really want her. Right? I'm talking to us guys. But our weak egos. Again, ladies' egos nice and strong. They know they can walk up this Walmart aisle two. And a dude going to say what's up. Aisle seven. Guy says what's up. Go to pump gas. Somebody say what's up. How you doing, baby? Us guys usually don't hear that. So we got this little weak ego thing going on. We got to stay. Oh, shoot. Who am I get with if I leave her? I don't like her, but I want that nighttime spice, you know? Yeah. You get all the, oh my gosh, what I'm going to tell my, my son, what I'm going to tell my daughter. Why you leaving, Dad? All that is better. Yeah. Go to your local lockup and ask why most of the guys down there. Domestic. Pleasing our ego. Lady cuss us out, push us, whatever. Sometimes innocent lockups. You call the police. Or she just pushed you, nothing happened, and the neighbors here scuffling, and police come, they lock you up. You know that. Sometimes the lady lies, say that she hit you, you know? They had to cut your losses. If you know you don't like it anymore, before you get caught cheating, cut ties. How am I make that to a little rhyme? Cut ties before you get caught cheating? I don't know. I got one other saying, uh, a breakup is better than a pregnancy. That's another thing. You know you don't want to be there with her. You know if they gave you enough money for, for what? Security deposit? First month rent? application fee you'll be out of it in your own little place now you have a little baby you think about child support hey maybe okay to go chance it with the child support if y'all make around the same amount of money you're gonna be okay you know share custody or whatever we talk about this because this is real right in a lot of our lives but you have options instead of staying there running them up probably getting with another lady bring in germs and diseases back to your lady. Not only just your lady, you gotta remember your kids too. You like, you wanna stay, you, you stay, y'all staying together for the kids. Okay, but both of y'all are probably cheating. You cheating, where your toothbrush at? Your toothbrush right there next to your kid's toothbrush. You can have all kinds of little herpes, gonorrhea on your toothbrush, you don't even know. And now it's on their toothbrush. Your washcloth, where's your washcloth and your poop? Rubbing up against your kid's washcloth and poop. People talking about, yeah, we're staying together for the kids, but then you're taking germs and stuff home to your kids, right? Not only the lady. Oh, yeah. See, I told you, boy, my feet feel all right. They ain't even hurting. <laughs> Timberlands ain't bad. Hey, those Nike boots better, though. Those Nike boots, man, you don't need no insoles for those boots. You put them on and start rolling. Oh, yeah. The Gamma 9. Ah. Uh, that thing inside. I think I'm gonna run. Where am I going, man? Gum again? Panel, I'm make a group for Panel Elite. Try to get the Superman cape thing. Get the name of it, the Ultraman, Ultraman cape. Yeah. A little division. Nice Saturday. Had some spaghetti yesterday. Remember, this is the last day to go to Chick-fil-A, boy. Tomorrow is closed for Sunday. That's when everybody want to go to Chick-fil-A. <laughs> Remember, fries, no salt. That chicken sandwich got a lot of soda in it, though. Watch it. See, I got to put that in there. My little brother, you know. He told me, watch it. Show that you getting older. <laughs> mm hmm Well, okay, my son, he... Dressed up as Pablo Escobar for Halloween. Oh man, the picture is so funny, man. <laughs> He's sitting there with some 
I think that whatever you got, bacon soda, whatever, in the little baggies. Look like drugs, and he had money coming out of his pocket. You know, look like the pictures of Pablo Escobar, you know. Pretty funny. <laughs> well, hey, y'all hear that? Those V8s, boy. That gas, look at my little thing. How much you guys pay to fill that thing up, boy? My father used to always say, yeah, you could buy a car, but it's the maintenance. <laughs> well, all right. Yeah, my nine. Y'all, there, take a little walk, y'all. Take a little walk. See y'all out there.